वेलकम गाइस दिस इज क्वेश्चन नंबर 73 ऑफ नेट दिसंबर 2018 एंड इट्स अ क्वेश्चन ऑफ लीनियर एलजेब्रा फ्रॉम द पार्ट सी ऑफ द पेपर सो लेट अस रीड इट लेट एम इज इक्वल टू दिस मैट्रिक्स गिवन दैट वन इज एन आइगन वैल्यू ऑफ कैपिटल एम देन व्हिच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग आर करेक्ट ओके द फर्स्ट ऑप्शन इज सेइंग दैट मिनिमल पॉलीनोमियल इज दिस सेकंड वन इज सेइंग दैट मिनिमल पॉलीनोमियल इज दिस third one is saying that m is not diagonalizable and fourth one is saying that 1 by 4 m inverse is equal to 1 by 4 times of m plus 3 identity so we have to check this thing so before proceeding what should you do firstly find out the remaining eigen value of this matrix okay so it is given that one is an eigen value so we have to find the remaining one okay so one thing you know about matrices that sum of the eigen value okay if i am assuming that lambda 1 lambda 2 lambda 3 are the eigen value then their sum is equal to the trace trace of the matrix and another thing that you know is that lambda 2 multiplied with lambda 3 will give you the determinant of the matrix okay so these two things you already know now it is given that one is an eigen value so this these two things will imply that lambda 2 plus lambda 3 is equal to minus 3 and lambda 2 dot lambda 3 is equal to minus 4 okay so what you have to do you have to solve this system okay so just solve this system you will get to know that lambda 2 is 1 and lambda 3 is 4 okay so you have two repeated eigen value okay so it is given to you that one is already an eigen value and uh, you got one and four as your eigen value so this is your eigen value okay so these are your eigen values now what you have to do in the question you have to find the minimal polynomial okay so before going to the minimal polynomial i will firstly suggest to do the op option third okay so if you try the option third so before trying option third you should remember these two note okay so the first note says that if all the eigen values if all the eigen values of m are distinct then your matrix then m is diagonalizable okay so this is what this node is saying now in the given question you have two repeated eigen value so this node will not work here okay so you have to check diagonalizability with another method okay so this node will not work here so you should use now node number 2 so suppose lambda 1 is the repeated eigen value so you see 1 is the repeated eigen value so what this note says that if algebraic multiplicity of 1 is equal to the geometric multiplicity of 1 okay if this thing is happening okay 1 is the repeated eigen value so if eigen value repeats you have to check the algebraic multiplicity and the geometric multiplicity of that eigen value so if this thing is happening then m is diagonalizable okay so if two eigen values are repeated okay suppose one one is repeated and there is another eigen value which is also repeated so you have to check algebraic multiplicity and geometric multiplicity for that eigen value also okay so if three eigen values are repeated you have to check it three times for every eigen value every repeated eigen value you have to check this thing okay so this will imply m is diagonalizable and if m is diagonalizable then algebraic multiplicity is equal to geometric multiplicity so this thing it if and only if now what you have to do you have to check diagonalizability so you have two repeated eigen value so you have to use this one note so you see your algebraic multiplicity is 2 one is repeated two times okay so your algebraic multiplicity is 2 now what is the formula to obtain geometric multiplicity okay so formula to obtain geometric multiplicity is n minus n is the order of the matrix minus rank of m that is your given matrix minus lambda i and what is lambda lambda is the repeated eigen value so you see your repeated eigen value is 1 
so you have to place one here okay so if you place one here it will create no effect so it will be m minus i now what is your n n is 3 in this case so you have to find this thing okay so if you find this thing then uh, just find this rank okay find just subtract m uh, identity from this m matrix so firstly calculate m matrix and then find the rank of that matrix then you will get to know that this thing is 3 minus 2 and which is equal to 1 so from these two things what you are concluding that your algebraic multiplicity is not equal to geometric multiplicity now this note is if and only if note that means if they are not equal then you can conclude that m is not diagonalizable okay so this is what you can conclude so third is correct now what first option is saying that m is diagonalizable uh, no not not this first option is saying that the minimal polynomial is this thing okay so if you have studied jordan canonical form in linear algebra okay so if you if you haven't studied it so just go through your book and just study it that how to write the jordan canonical form of any given matrix okay so if you have studied that so supposing one is true okay i'm assuming that you know jordan canonical form i'm not going to explain it here so just go through your books or notes whatever you have and then just study the jordan canonical form because it's very important to study jordan canonical form it will be very difficult okay to find the minimal polynomial of this thing okay it will be very difficult because you cannot calculate the minimal polynomial that much easy way okay you, uh, of course you can calculate but it will take about five to six minutes to calculate this thing and in for the exam purpose you cannot give more than three or to four minutes to any question okay so this question will take about 10 minutes if you don't know jordan canonical form so i will suggest you that you have to study that thing okay so suppose one is true that means that means minimal polynomial of your capital m matrix is given by x minus 1 into x plus 4 okay so if you have studied this thing jordan canonical form so you see your characteristic polynomial will be from these eigenvalue what you can write you can write your characteristic polynomial to be x minus lambda 1 into x minus lambda 2 into x minus lambda 3 okay this is the way to write characteristic polynomial if you know uh, know the eigenvalues now you see lambda 1 and lambda 2 are equal so it will be x minus 1 to the whole square okay and this thing will be x minus 4 so from this thing okay okay i'm sorry there's a it should be minus 4 here okay so eigenvalue should be minus 4 here so eigenvalue is minus 4 that's why plus is coming here now so i i have i have written it wrongly so just correct it it will be minus 4 now what you see your characteristic uh, characteristic polynomial is like this and your minimal polynomial is like this so by this thing what you can do you can write your jordan canonical form so if you write your jordan canonical form it will be 1 1 and minus 4 okay and all other entries are 0 so this is your jordan canonical form now what you are seeing in jordan canonical form that jordan canonical form is actually diagonal okay it's a diagonal matrix now you know every matrix is similar to its jordan canonical form that means since it is diagonal therefore m will be diagonalizable okay so that's a contradiction here okay because if m is not diagonalizable then your jordan canonical form cannot be a diagonal matrix okay what is the meaning of diagonalizability diagonalizability means that your matrix is similar to some diagonal matrix okay so m is similar to j and j is diagonal that means it which is a contradiction because we have already proved that it is not diagonalizable so this thing contradicts here so directly this will imply that this cannot be your minimal polynomial okay now what do you know you know that every root of characteristic is a root of minimal okay so if this thing is not your minimal polynomial so the only possibility that you are left with is this so this second one is correct and first one is incorrect now what you have to do you have to calculate m inverse okay 
now what do you know that no eigen value is zero that what can you conclude from that thing since no eigen value is zero then you can conclude that m inverse exist okay now what is your characteristic polynomial your characteristic polynomial is x minus 1 whole square into x plus 4 okay now you know that every characteristic polynomial satisfies its matrix so since it is the characteristic polynomial of your given matrix capital m therefore it has to satisfy capital m so if i place m in place of x what you are going to get you will get result zero okay now just expand it so what will be the expansion it will be m square okay it will be 4 iota now it will be m square minus 2m plus identity into m plus 4 identity this thing will be m uh, m cube plus 4 m square minus 2 m square plus 8 m plus m plus 4i okay which is equal to 0 now from this thing what you are getting that uh, m cube 4 minus 2 so it will be 2 m square and 8 m is there so it will be 9 m plus 4i okay so i am assuming that my calculations are correct if if they are not correct just then just calculate i am just providing you the method okay now just apply okay just take it on the right hand side okay so what you will get i is 1 over 4 times of m cube plus 2 m square plus 9 m so this is your identity matrix now just operate m both side okay so now just operate m both side what you are going to get you are going to get what i am saying that you have to operate m both side m inverse both side not m you have to operate m inverse both sides so if you operate m inverse both side so it will be m inverse here it will be square here it will be 2m here and it will be 9 identity okay so if my calculations are correct then this is your m inverse okay let us check it again m square minus 2m plus uh, identity okay it's correct it will be m plus 4 now it will be m cube plus 4m square it will be minus 2m square okay this thing will be minus 8 okay this thing will be minus 8 so this thing will be minus 8 so you are going to get 7 here okay what you are going to get minus 7 here so this thing will be 7 and minus uh, minus okay I will just place minus here and minus here okay whatever you do okay whatever the calculations are this option is incorrect okay you have to use this method okay you are getting my point so this option is incorrect so the correct options are two and three okay thank you guys